seat. No, I'm not. I'm Wally George. <laughs> oh, what the heck? I'm hot seat, and this is Wally George. Okay, here we are. I don't give a darn. How y'all doing? Wally! All right. Now listen. In a moment, we're going to introduce our our two freaky guests, and then we're going to take take some questions from our fantastic audience. But first, it's the mailbag. By the way, I want to welcome all of you at home. I haven't had a chance to say hello to you yet. I've been talking to all this massive audience. I don't want to exaggerate, so I'll tell you the truth. We have 3,000 people here tonight. And of course, and of course we know at home we have 20 million people. Of that sign over there, the meat and potatoes of America. Can we get that one? Yeah. <laughs> All right. That's great. I'm glad to hear that. Now, let's get our, our first questioner up. Come on up to the podium. Let's have your first name and your question, please. Hi, I'm Mike from Newport Beach. All right, Mike. Wally, I want to know what you think about uh, the new bill trying to be passed by Congress about the minimum wage for teenagers to $2.60. Well, I think it's a very good bill because I think that's going to encourage employers to, haulage, uh, 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 to hire a lot more youth in the summer times. And I think we should give jobs to more of the youth, don't you? Yeah! Thank you very much. Yes, take your stupid glasses off. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. I want to know if, uh, if Oscar grew any hair. What was that again? I want to know if Oscar grew any hair from that, that dude with the haircut. Well, uh, Oscar is going to have some uh, photographs taken on Monday. And this is the fourth month, Oscar. And so far, we have been closely examining Oscar's head, and I can't see one lousy hair that has grown in four months. But we'll soon find out. <laughs> okay. Okay, come on. Okay, yes, your first uh, name and your question. My name is Steve from Arcadia, okay. and I've been watching the news lately, and I've noticed that Mondale, all he does is put down Reagan. He doesn't, he has no platform, and I think this is what everybody... Not only that, he doesn't got any brains either. Yes, yes. Hi, I'm Steve from Toronto, Canada. All I right. just want from Toronto, Canada. Yeah. You drove all the way down to see my show. Well, not exactly, but <laughs> <laughs> I, I moved down. I moved down. Don't I wanted to come me. down. When I say you drove down here from Canada to I see did. my show, You're you right. drove here from Canada to yeah. see my show. I did. All right. Yeah. Okay. Now go ahead. Go ahead. I, I just want to know what you uh, think of Trudeau's resignation of the country up north there. I I couldn't be more happy. All right. I'm, I'm, wait. Stay, I'm not through with you yet. Stay there. I couldn't be happier to see that wimp out of there. And I was sick and tired of the way at that conference in Europe, how that crazy maniac Trudeau took on the president of the United States. He's not good at the shine our president's shoes. Thank you. I'll be right back. All right. 